Hey guys, welcome back to Adventure Camp and Tactical Nut here. And today I have not one, but two Falco belly band holsters for you. Hey guys, let's go ahead and run around this thing so you can see uh, what it's like, what it has to offer, and why I like this thing so much. Yes, I'm going to just go ahead and kind of ruin the review already, but <laughs> just going to go ahead and get that out of the way. Um, first off, I got this because Falco sent me both of these plus one other. I'm going to be doing the third one in a separate review. Um, but they really wanted me to test this out, and I'll tell you the truth, like in the beginning I really have never had any interest in a belly band holster um, just didn't seem like it would be that practical you know for me and what I do but once getting this it's really changed my mind so I really think you need to know about this so start off with all right you can see here you have a pretty big velcro uh, space here so this way you can uh, get plenty of adjustment out of it um, they do come in different sizes, so you don't have to worry. It's not a one-size-fits-all kind of thing. Uh, it does have a pocket right here. I was just wearing this one just a little bit ago. I've been out running errands. Um, so this little pocket right here will fit. I do carry a, you know, kind of front pocket wallet from Recycled Firefighter. Um, <clears throat> has a little spot here that I put a pocket knife. Has a pouch here where, as you can see, there is a spare magazine. This is e adjustable. Um, so depending on the, the height of your mag, you can move this strap up or down. Um, you do have a third pouch, the same size as the other wallet pouch, along with the Falco logo right there. And then, of course, just the elastic back and another pouch for, you could potentially put a flashlight. I do carry mine like that sometimes, um, or another smaller magazine. Now, this one was made for the Hellcat. And as you see here, it does have... All right, sorry about that. So as you can see here, we have a Kydex holster mounted to this. And there is a Kydex right here that is also made onto the holster as well. Um, now, I got this one without a light on it, um, just because this is my wife's. Uh, it's her EDC. So um, she really hasn't asked for a light, but. I'm almost certain that, and I'm going to contact the company just to see that I can actually buy just another holster and that way, and you know, one that's made with a light and that way I can just take this one off and mount this one to it. I'm almost 100% positive I can do that. So um, don't quote me just yet. When I find out from them, I'll put it in the description below. Um, but there's a couple different ways you can wear this. Now, when I work my second job at a shooting range, I wear this outside the waistband because they want us to open carry. Uh, this way we can be seen obviously around the range and around the shop. Um, and so as you can see here, perfect. Hear that click? Good retention right here, right? And then of course, you know, I'll have like my keys in one of the pouches, a flashlight so I can keep stuff out of my pocket. Uh, just to show you an example on the other side. If I wanted to put it in the pouch back here, I could. I would do this with it off first just so I could see, make sure I got that clip on there properly. <laughs> I think it went over it. But this way, sort of like you could call it your bat belt, right? Um, now, I am wearing a black shirt, so it's going to make it a little bit harder to see, but this is just what I've been wearing today. Um, but there's another way you can wear this, and I will put that on off camera and then bring you back all right so here we go this little stool out of the way um, this is as you can see conceals pretty well still get a good crisp clean draw um, I wear it here at the three o'clock sometimes sometimes I'll wear it back here at the four um, but Either way is extremely comfortable because this does flex with you. And as you can see here, very little of it is sticking out of my belt line. Um, you wouldn't need to wear a belt. And so if you didn't want to, obviously you don't have to. Um, but that just depends on your preference, right? But I'm telling you what, 
this is extremely comfortable shockingly so i'm i gotta tell you as i show you the other one this one i had made for my cz my p10c this one i had made with the light i have the claris gl1 and as you can hear both of them have very solid retention both of them have the sweat guard right here to protect your gun from the sweat that you're gonna have um, especially here in the south uh, it's just started to warm up again so this is really nice um, I set mine up pretty much the same way for this one so I'll put a knife in it I'll put a spare mag right here my wallet right here and then of course if you need to put anything else another spare mag and or anything else while it's size right if you had a small if you had a cell phone actually let's just see here I haven't tried this because I don't wear my phone like that I always keep it in my back pocket but you could potentially keep your phone in it and let me go ahead and tell you why I like these so much and why I've been so pleasantly surprised um, these are perfect for when you're wearing pants shorts or anything like that that doesn't require a belt so uh, gym shorts jogging shorts anything like that uh, bathing suit um, sweatpants jogging pants did I already say that <laughs> I can't remember all right so yeah so these are perfect because when you wearing something that doesn't require a belt you don't need one to hold this up and to carry this around um, now this one doesn't conceal as well I have to wear this one at the four o'clock simply because of the length of the grip um, so but for me that's not a big deal I carry it four o'clock all the time I carry most a lot of appendix and four o'clock very rarely at the three unless I'm at work and I'm open carrying um, because those are just the more convenient ways of concealing but I got to tell you guys both of these have been absolutely outstanding I was so happy that I got these that I just can't tell you because I mean literally had it not been for them recommending them to me and wanting me to review them I probably never would have bought one but also every other belly band I've seen and this is what to me also sets it apart um, is just the elastic stuff right um, so this is the first one with the kydex that I've seen and I absolutely love that it gives you great retention and you know this will last longer than the el elasticity of you know a pouch like this that's holding a gun because these eventually just wear out because they just get loose from being stretched but kydex doesn't do that and i love that about these holsters um all right guys hopefully this will help you in your purchasing decisions of finding a belly band holster i highly recommend it um oh yeah also it has the falco pouch on the back yeah but i highly recommend these incredibly comfortable especially with summer coming up um, warmer springs you know it's great weather to not have to wear clothes that have a belt so that but you can still be prepared at the same time um, so and you may have heard me mention falco in other holster reviews they are the ones that make the holsters for that craft holster sell as well this just happened to come come directly to me from falco all right guys once again hopefully this will help you in your purchasing decisions of finding a fantastic holster that will meet a lot of your needs all right guys in the meantime be prepared and have fun just had a quick thought i'm like the review wouldn't be complete unless i showed you that you can wear these right without pants that require a belt these are a pair of link active shorts that i wear to the gym all the time right and so this is perfect example of how you can wear one still be prepared easily concealed right and still extremely comfortable all right talk to you later